hello friends welcome to our channel google galaxy today we are going to discuss our topic electricity the branch of engineering which deals with the electrons in motion is known as current electricity that is the branch that deals with the free electrons branch deals with free electrons we called as we called as current electricity we called as current electricity we have studied in the junior classes that an atom consists of nucleus having positively charged and electrons are keep on revolving around this nucleus and electrons keep on moving around the nucleus in a particular orbit and the name of these orbits are k shell k l m up to up to infinity an atom consists of nucleus having positively charged called proton and electrons revolve around this nucleus in a particular orbit and the name of orbit is k l m n but we see that the electron present in the last orbit of an atom are less powerfully attracted by the nucleus than that of inner electrons i'll repeat again that the electrons present in the outermost orbit has less attraction with the nucleus than that of inner electrons so we say that such electrons are weakly bound with the nucleus such electrons are weakly bound with the nucleus so they can be easily removed so they can be easily removed or we can say detach or we can say we can easily detach it when the electron detach from the atom we called we called as free electron we called as free electron when we say free electron when the electron which is weakly bounded with the nucleus when an electron easily bound with the nucleus is removed or detached by applying a battery how we can remove the electron from its outermost shell by using thus remote cell tv remote cell or battery it will it will force the electron to become free so we called as free electrons giving you an example that a copper wire everything around us is made up of atoms similarly this copper wire is made up of atoms it is not made up of a single atom it is made up of million trillions of atom and each atom contains the electrons which is weakly bounded with the nucleus when we apply when we apply a battery to it what is the symbol of battery you have to just remember that this one is a symbol of battery cell sorry cell if i just attached in this manner it is a symbol of battery this cell is going to push these electrons this cell is going to push the electrons and electrons become free so these free electrons will start moving 
फ्रॉम नेगेटिव टू पॉजिटिव एंड नेगेटिव टू पॉजिटिव एंड कॉन्सिचुएंट कॉन्सिच्यूट द इलेक्ट्रिक करंट दिस इज फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन्स 